Hello friends, now we'll start the mathematics to the first chapter similarity and practice set 1.1. I will explain the properties of areas of two triangles when the base and height are not equal, when base is equal, height is equal and the important examples from the practice set 1.1. Now let us start. The practice set 1.1 similarity. Now let us start similarity. Ratio of in this chapter we will learn ratio of areas of two triangles. Basic proportionality theorem, converse of basic proportionality theorem, test of similarity of triangles, property of an angle bisector of a triangle, property of areas of similar triangles the ratio of intercept made by made on transversal by three parallel lines these are the topics now let us recall some basic concept we have studied ratio and the proportion the statement the numbers a and b are in the ratio m upon n is also written as the number a and b are in proportion m as to n for this concept we consider positive real number we know that the length of line segment and area of any figure are positive real numbers we know the formula now next we know the formula of area of the triangle. What is the area of the triangle? That is a 1 upon 2 base into height. Now let us learn. What is the new thing is here? Ratio of areas of two triangles. Now the first is in this example. See this. That is in triangle ABC. What is the AD is the height of this triangle. And the BC is the base. In next triangle PQR. QR is the base and PS is the height. Now, I want to find out the ratio of areas of these two triangles. Area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle PQR is equals to 1 upon 2 into BC, which is the base, into AD, which is the height. That is 1 upon 2 BC into AD upon the next triangle, that is the PQR. Its the base is QR. 1 upon 2 QR into height is PS and in this way 1 upon 2 QR into PS. 1 upon 2, 1 upon 2 get cancelled and you will get area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle PQR is equals to BC into AD upon QR into PS. Hence, the ratio of areas of two triangles is equals to the ratio of the products of their bases and the corresponding height. In this way. Now the next is base of suppose that in general the sums are general consider the base of a triangle is a B1 and height is H1. Base of another triangle is a B2 and height is H2. Then the ratio of their areas equals to B1 into H1 upon B2 into H2. Now the condition one. If the heights of both triangles are equal, then that is in this triangle, the height AB is in triangle ABC, AD is the height, which is H. In triangle PQR, PS is the height, which is H. Now, in this case, for these two triangles, heights are equal. Therefore, area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle PQR is equal to base into height bc into h upon qr into h now hh get cancelled and you will get bc upon qr therefore area of triangle abc upon area of triangle pqr is equals to bc upon qr now the next the property of areas of two triangles with equal heights is equals to the ratio of their corresponding bases now if the 
Now see this the condition 2. If the bases of both triangles are equal, then now in this triangle, that is a triangle ABC and the triangle APB. AB is the base which is the common. The height of the triangle ABC is CD and the height of the triangle APB is PQ. Therefore, area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle APB is equals to AB into CD upon. Again, the base and the height of the triangle APB that is the AB into PQ. Therefore, AB AB get cancelled and you will get CD upon PQ. That is a CD upon PQ. It means that therefore area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle APB is equals to H1 upon H2. The property the ratio of areas of two triangles with equal bases is equals to the ratio of their corresponding heights. Now we see the solid example. This is an example is also very important. In the adjoining figure, the A is perpendicular to the C. Now see the triangle ABC. A is a perpendicular to BC and TF is a perpendicular to again BC extended. A is equals to 4 and DF is equals to 6. Now, if we see this, the triangle ABC, ABC and the triangle DBC, DBC. triangle But the base is the same. But the ratio, area of the, their ratio is equals to their corresponding height. Therefore, area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle dbc is equals to ae upon df that is the bases are equal hence areas are proportional to height what about the height of first angle is 4 therefore it is a 4 upon and the second is 6 4 upon 6 that is a 2 upon 3 therefore area of triangle abc upon area of triangle dbc is equals to 2 upon 3 now remember this that is the ratio of areas of two triangles is equals to the ratio of the products of their bases and corresponding height areas of triangles with equal heights are proportional to their corresponding bases if the heights are equal then their areas are proportional to their corresponding bases Areas of triangles with equal bases are proportional to their corresponding heights. I will start the practice set. Now here in this uh, practice set there are a number of examples but I had selected only the two examples which asked in the number of times in the board exam. Therefore those uh, some student that is uh, those students who want to refer all the examples they may refer but in point of view of myself. Major Drushti Kodatma, he donuts examples just the math watch. Base of a triangle is a 9 and height is 5. Base of another triangle is a 10 and the height is 6. Find the ratio of areas of these triangles. Now see this here. Let the base and the height and the area of the first triangle be B1, H1, and H A1 respectively. If the base height and the area of the second triangle is B2, H2 and A2 respectively. What about the first that is the base B1 and H1. B1 is 9, H1 is 5. B1 is 9, H1 is 5. What about the second that is a 10, B1, B2 is a 10 and H2 is 6. In this way, the ratio of areas of two triangles is equals to the ratio of the product of their bases and the corresponding height. Therefore, A1 upon A2 is equal to B1 into H1 upon B2 into H2, 9 into 5 upon 10 into 6 and therefore you will get A1 upon A2 is equal to 3 by 4 to the division then you will get 3 by 4 and hence the ratio of areas of 
the triangle is 3 as to 4. Now this problem is also very important number of the times board has asked this type of the question. In figure BC is perpendicular to AB and AD is perpendicular to AB. BC is equals to 4 and AD is equals to 8. BC is equals to 4, AD is equals to 8. Now if you see this triangle ABC and the triangle ABD, both of them have the common base which is AB. That is triangle ABC and the triangle ADB, ADB have the same base AB. Areas of triangles with equal bases are proportional to their corresponding height. Therefore, area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle ADB is equals to BC upon AD. And what is the value of BC? That is the BC is a 4 and AD is 8. That is equals to 1 upon 2. If we give the division to this or make the lowest, then you will get area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle ADB is equals to 1 upon 2. The lazar bhag dila to me. 4 name, 4 ones and 4 twos are, that is you will get 1 upon 2 and hence answer is area of triangle ABC upon area of triangle ADB is equals to 1 upon 2 and hence in this way I had completed the important questions from the practice set 1.1. Now we will see again next video till then goodbye.